this is tall and manly my hard crying man that entered the world of Gelenor just over a year ago with one singular goal to get all of the best highest level gear in the entire game for every combat style Earlier on in the series, we grinded Krosis for over 100 hours to get a full set of Crypt Bloom. And then from that point, we took our talents to Zuck as well as Hard Mode Zuck, getting ourselves the best magic cape in the game. After a brief stint at Virago where we couldn't get a wand, but we did get a Seismic Singularity, it was time for us to grind Hard Mode Karapak until we got a Fractured Staff of Armadol. This took over 660 kills and well over 100 hours, but with that done, we've got a really good magic setup. In the last video, we got our first Raziel kills and our first Raziel drops, but then we encountered a slight problem. Without vulnerability bombs, the boss fight is extremely slow, and although I have an absolute ton of Bagratarexes, the time they take to grow is absolutely ridiculous, going upwards of 80 hours for the worst growth stage. And because of that, I'm kind of vulnerability bomb locked, and I'd rather not just go to Raziel for about an hour a day with the vuln bombs that I get as my dinosaurs grow. So instead, I think it's time to enter what is sure to be an extremely fun side quest. There's one upgrade with Necromancy that is not gained through Necromancy. All of the armor is obtained from Raziel, and all the weapons are also obtained from Raziel. But then you've got the prayers, and in particular, the tier 99 Ruination Prayer, which is dropped from the Angel of Death. This is a boss I've not done in five years, and I cannot wait to try it out on a hard Iron Man. It should be an absolute ton of fun, and this video will not end until I have myself a Praisal Codex. I don't care how many kills it takes, how many hours it takes, we're gonna get this thing done right now. Welcome back to the adventures of Tall and Manly Necromancy Edition. It's time to accomplish my ultimate goal of dying in a really embarrassing way on a hardcore. Can I upgrade my generator to make it just something that looks a little less sus? Oh, I can. That's actually worse. Just let me get my heck hound. We're not three minutes into the Angel of Death arc and we've already encountered our first issue, which is of course that I don't even have access to Angel of Death. In order to access AOD, we need access to the ancient prison. And to do that, we need to assemble the frozen key. Once our frozen key is assembled, we also wanna get a full set of ancient ceremonial gear so that we can skip kill count and access the next bank as often as we would like. So before we get to Angel of Death, we're gonna have to take care of both of those things. Fortunately for us, this shouldn't take a whole lot of time, so let's get it done. Let's get our frozen key piece and let's body some necks. Where, where? Got it, Thanos. Oh. Okay, we're fine. One more piece. Wait, already? I got all the first kill. Uh, where? Oh, there it is. Easy, thank you guys. Okay, so now I've got a frozen key. So let's unlock the next door. Okay, so we need to gear for like the longest next trip ever. All right, it's next time. Oh, this is so sick. This is my first next kill, by the way. Dude, why is my hit chance so low? 70, I mean, 75 is not that bad, but we're definitely going to want to Nihil in 20 when we come back, for sure. Also, ignore the bad P1. I didn't have Conjurers, so. Yeah, we can just Soul Split Camp, and she just dies. Dude, Blood Phase was too. This is awesome. Yeah, I'm like using no food. This is awesome. I think I should have put her on Persistent Rage, but it's fine. She can't hit me. And then she's death marked. <laughs> First next kill, locked and loaded. Awesome stuff. Absolutely beautiful. And then yeah, because we have hit caps here, we want to prioritize things that hit um, multiple times. So like Volley of Souls should be really good. And it is. That's another PR. This is so much fun. Any droppers? Good kill. Dude, we're getting two minute, 30 second next kills right now. That's my fifth kill. Locked and loaded. Ancient Ceremonial Mask, big. My first ceremonial piece. Oh my god. We just basically one ticked it. Okay. Oh my god. I almost died. Whoa. Life transfer stalls you in place for a second. I just like 13k'd myself. Get some blood flowing. Bang. What? Run. Ooh. Pernix Cowl coming in. His first next drop coming in. Still no ancient ceremonial, but uh, we take those. That is level 104 necromancy coming in. My next. Ooh, Virtus book coming in. Nice. Ceremonial pants. Yes. Get in. Ancient ceremonial gloves. Let's go, dude. Okay, three out of five. Ancient ceremonial top. 
Wait, we're actually one piece off. Ooh, ancient ceremonial legs, a dupe. You can skip sales tax if you shoplift. Nope, don't do that. Bad advice, bad advice, bad advice. Sorry. Did I win? Ooh, Torva full helm. Let's go, dude. That's actually such a good drop. Also, one of the nicest looking items in the game. Look at that icon. Any drops? Oh my goodness. Arnix boots coming in. Dude, this next romancy thing is going great. Not in like a body pillow way, but in a next with necromancy, not romancing next because the not the not like the body pillow like the wait gloves no i need boots could i just put them on my feet like socks three three four and one and no boots yeah that's not great but hey these things happen i did get two lanterns so you know pernix chaps dude let's go i was gonna lose a an og pernix chaps like the meme pernix chaps. let's two shot this bang and bang <laughs> Come on, dude. It's so much fun. Boots! Wait, we're good. We're actually good. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. 70 kills. Not bad. I'm really about to spend 10 mil on this. 10 million coins. Gildor's most expensive doorstop. Real. Okay, we've got a team and two hardcores. Oh, God. <laughs> this is the worst idea ever. Goodbye, tall and manly. I'm scared. Threads of fate. And then kaboom. And then sight. Go one, two, three. Kaboom. Did they die? Blow up the zombie. Oh, they died. Oh, it was Fuma's first. Okay, we're fine. Okay, now I have to pray wizard. I've got to redo my conjures, I think. So who's doing the pool? Do two people do know we ignore them, don't we? I think we ignore them. I think we're supposed to ignore pools because nobody likes swimming. And then we pray magic until Glacies dies, I think. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Everything's fine. I did not use finger of death a single time. Oh no. Auto retaliate will get you killed last phase. Oh, that's actually real and true. Wait, bad time to ask us. What type of insta kill is it? Soft. Okay, good to know. Good to know. Good to know. You just sign. Okay, great. Perfect. Okay, this is going well. We got this team. First angel of death kill in the books. Oh, that was so scary. Oh, I did not like that. I didn't use any food though. Sorry, I have to pick my promised gift. Oh, that was so scary. I kind of hated that. My first bomb. I'm going to be so scared. <laughs> Pog. I got a talent. Wait, incandescent energies? Dude, I'm literally not using food. Okay. So basically, I should be wearing power gear probably and not be on a hellhound. Cool. Cool. We're learning. We're learning. We're learning. Dude, look at the surges. He's an AODR. Oh no, he's not an AOD here. He lied. He's an imposter. He lied to get on the team. He's not a pro. Pog. I didn't use any food. Oh no, wait, I'm gonna mid bomb accidentally. I'm not careful. That's the wrong way. Okay, uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. That's a bad spot. I know, I'm not an AOD here. I'm sorry. My quick thinking skills, all right? They're lagging a bit. Soda's gonna get invited back. I am gonna not get invited back. <laughs> oh my god, Soda got a core! She risked it all going with us, and she actually got a drop. Oh my god, Soda got a back to back! Core and then a wand! What? No way! Back to back to back? Dude, dry. As a team, we are dry. No! I just. You guys didn't see it. Delete the VOD, delete the VOD, de delete the VOD. This video is sponsored by and made possible by Control. Control is for anyone with a busy lifestyle. Something I personally have a lot of difficulty with is when I'm streaming or working long hours, I frequently forget to eat. And then after my streams lately, I've been going to the rock climbing gym. And as soon as I get on the wall, I realize that not eating was maybe not the best idea. And I feel absolutely terrible. With control in the picture, when I'm busy and I don't have time to eat or make a proper meal, it literally takes 20 seconds. I've tried all sorts of different solutions to this in my lifetime, and Control is by far the best experience I've had with any kind of meal replacement. Not only is it absolutely delicious, but it's also not chalky or thick, and it goes down super easily. 
And because of how easy it is to prepare, I'm finding that I'm ordering in food less because why spend 30 bucks and wait a half an hour to get something delivered when I have a nutritionally complete delicious meal at my fingertips? By far, my favorite flavor is cookies and cream. And that's what you're looking at right here. And I've been drinking it every single day. It has 23 grams of protein, 22 essential vitamins and minerals, eight grams of fiber, only one gram of sugar, and one full serving is 230 calories that leaves me satiated and full throughout the entire day. If your story is anything like mine, where I'm trying to eat a little healthier, order in less, but also keep my calories and my macros where they're supposed to be, try out Control at the link in the description down below or on screen at drinkcontrol.com forward slash RS guy. And one last thing, if you're a fan of saving money, you can check out the Bundle Builder, which will save you an additional 20% off your entire order, and it stacks with my creator code as well, that'll get you an extra 10%. Oh my god, and it still phases at the exact same point. Bro, am I even helping? I should not even show up one kill. And they're gonna be like, whoa, PR. Wait, we're gonna sub two this hour easily. That's a 201. Ooh, Lil Virtus with appraisal codex for the mainscapers. Congrats, guys. Also, that's a sub two, which is kind of cool. I did feel like I got off a really good rotation until the end. Nah, I'm not going. I'm not going. I'm going. That was really scary. 158, not bad. Oh, that's a PR. Wait, Snapdragon Seeds? AOD dropped Snapdragon Seeds. Dude, I've literally been using Super Restores from Krill. Oh god! Um. Fuck. Okay, uh, that's my first time signing on this account. Um. Focus. Oh god! Oh, my heart is racing right now. My heart is absolutely racing. But I don't want to tell you. Okay, we're good. Oh my god. Dude, that was scary. I haven't tried my sign on Anacrania in a long time. I was like, wait, what if it doesn't work? Yeah, dude, Zathro's the only person more nervous than me. He was like, wait, I'm gonna lose my job. He was like PMing everyone on team. Please intercept him. Okay, wait, these guys look grown, right? Surely those are adults? Yes! Bottle dinosaur roars. Bottle dinosaur roars. Bottle dinosaur roars. I feel like my venomous dinosaurs don't deserve to eat. That is level... <laughs> 105 necromancy. Awesome. Oh, rip Pyrus. Ooh. A huge praisal codex. It reads them out to you out loud so that you don't have to. That's so funny. You can turn on like bomb warnings and stuff. Should I turn it on? I'm thinking about it. No, okay, no, I can use my eyes. I'm gonna use my eyes. I can't. There's a three, two, one bomb countdown. <laughs> this bomb countdown is gonna scare the crap out of me. <laughs> oh, I did a terrible job that guy. Kaboom. Ah! Okay, I'm sorry. Who the frick made this plugin? No! <sighs> My heart! Why? I hated that. Okay, 2F, and then bang. And then bang. It really does. T Look at the damage on that. It's insanely fun. This guy's an AOD -er. <laughs> Whoo, that gets the blood flowing. Well, 147? Holy moly. Chef is teaching us some rots. Okay, this partial potion producer is actually really sick. I'm just putting it out there. This thing is hype. I did no work and I just got a thousand potions. Any appraisal codices? Catadine seeds? I'm cool with that. Nice. Okay, game sounds. Oh, Katie got a codex. Congrats. Dude, one day it's gonna be mine. Oh my goodness, Mika got a wand! Holy moly. Dude, all the mains on this on this team are making billions of coins. And then it's me, the Iron Man.
I'm gonna laugh if my first drop is a uh, is a chest. That is the kind of thing I would do though, right? Good luck team. I mean, y'all got three drops in an hour. You guys absolutely cooked, but thank you all for kills. Yeah, see if we get a fourth, why not? Maybe the irons can eat. The irons cannot eat, but that is my 100th angel of danger bat kill. Super fun. Awesome boss. Come on, danger chicken. It's time for you to pay out. Why are you only 66 necromancy? Ooh, that's a gamer that needs uh, one clothes, Jesus. And two, definitely needs a, a pretzel wand, but mostly clothes. Huh. Bob! La Bomba! Oh my god. Pathing! What the crap was that pathing? Dude, what was my character doing? Salvage. Ooh, Prazel Codex for squid. Huh. What is this pathing? Oh my god! What the f Dude, what is- It's like I have auto retaliate on, but I don't! What the hell is this? My heart is racing! And what do you got, Free Blast? Oh my goodness, Katie with the Codex on the first kill! Ooh, that was spooky. Oh, I didn't like that. To not keep going. I guess while they do their splits, I'll do a herp run. Irons really do get the short end of the stick. Everyone on the team made 450 mil. And then there's me. My job is to grow my own herbs for my own potions that I have to make. I'm just saying, I have no idea why Jagex hasn't hired me yet. Like genuinely, the stuff that comes up, that I come up with. And then RuneScape, what it could be is they could do a collab with Arby's. And it'd be the Arby's meat sweat bar. Oh my goodness! Mika got her core! 600 kill count, Fallen Angel! That's insane! She's only got 600 kill count! Wait, Mika, you're a monster! That is level 106 Necromancy coming in. Oh my, Mika! Girl, what is going on? Mika has the golden spoon. Oh! Wait, <laughs> that was so good. I was trying to keep my skeleton alive. Oh my goodness. I had a thousand life points. Wait, I should have ring of life there. I think it's possible that ring of life doesn't work on life transfer. What is going on double? Bro, what? Dude, where's, where's mine? Dude, everyone who's, everyone who's AOD'd with me has made like two and a half billion coins. Oh my goodness, the other iron? Okay, I know it might look like I'm I'm coping really hard. I am. You know what it probably is? I said some stuff about the AOD community a couple years ago. So while killing AOD, they were so bored because the boss dies so fast that they actually found a real way to summon up an undead demon and curse me. Oh my god, I'm signing to that. Ugh. Oh god! Um, uh, okay. I'm okay. Eat food. Ugh. <laughs> Kill the boss! Not my best work. We grab a cheeky life refresher. Yeah, I just got marked at a bad time. It's okay. Gets the blood flowing, though. Whew. That's a PR. 1 minute 44. Which one poisons you? Is that Fumus? Dude, Fumus is crazy. It is so dangerous. So we use overload salves at EOD. Okay, by overload salves, you mean regular anti-poison that I bought from the random dude in Karemja earlier today? I think that's what you mean to say. That's my 300th AOD kill, by the way. You know what? I'm putting on the skybox that I used to use at AOD in 2017. That's how desperate we are. This skybox is a piece of history. Oh my god, Moxie got a wand. <laughs> I'm so happy for you. These tears, they're just... I'm just so happy for you. That is level 107 farming command. Nice. Yeah, see, this is what we needed. We needed just give it some time, get the bone bombs flowing. I'm excited about today. I, I think today's the day either I die or we, we get the AOD drop we needed. Okay, look what look at the energies. I have 50,000. This is the most ends I've ever had in my life. What do you got for me, boss? Onyx bull tips. That's okay. Good to... Wait, look at the pile I got. My first time off aura? Can we get some claps in chat for Nathan, who actually went ham today? 
got the video out on time. Despite me sending him a bunch of changes I needed made like two hours ago. Uh, sorry, what's the Fortnite account to send the V-Bucks to? Oh, sorry, it's Robux. Sorry, what's the Roblox account? How many Roblox was it again per video? It was like five or six? Three Roblox. Okay, yeah, just uh, just send me an invoice. Oh, three because I used to give Kochi two Roblox. Oh, yeah, yeah, true. Yeah. The first Necromancer and the worst employer. Hey, enjoy your Roblox, dude. Don't spend them all at once. I feel good about this, Kel. Is what I was going to say. Next, Kel. <laughs> Actually baited. I'm very happy with my current role, but if you're not enjoying it, uh, yeah, please let me know. <gasps> oh, sh**. Oh my god. Uh, whose bomb was that? Potentially try to not do that. That would be good. <laughs> All right, please. This luck ring, I might have to disassemble it. It's clearly not working. She's broken. That is my 400th Angel of Death kill. One singular drop in seven hours of Angel of Death. That is as bad as it gets. It really is. Ryan, put this in the video. It's happening this hour. All right. No! Wait! That's a appraisal one! Look at the beam! Look how tall that beam is! That beam is like if I'm 8 feet tall! That's an 18 foot beam! Oh, I don't need that for anything! That's actually a really good drop though because I've got the uh, seismic singularity. I'm upgrading my wand from a cyber wand to a appraisal wand. Our current issue is I still don't have a single praise on Codex and we're 430 kills deep. So unfortunately the AOD art continues, but that's a really, really sick drop. That's really cool. And I don't mind having a slightly longer term approach to this. Like in the future, once they buff up the other styles, it's going to be good. Back to back. Other team got a Codex. You know, I feel the worst for here's Smitty. Smitty desperately needs GP. She's been joining for these hours. She learned the boss so that she could, she could hang out and kill the boss with us. And every hour she's done this her third hour, zero drops. Oh my god, no way! What? Look at the one in the core! In like eight kills! I did the same thing as Soda! I literally have no use for this at all. I just need the prayer. I have appraisal set on my hardcore. We're getting the rare thing that I don't need instead of the common thing that I do need. <laughs> the AOD arc continues. A new updated look at the log. First off, I have a ton of energy, which is great because we have now done 446 kills without a codex, but we spooned a wand and a core in a span of four kills. I like genuinely don't plan on using magic for anything in the next several months because necromancy is so much cheaper upkeep and more effective. Loot from four AOD kills. What are my opinions on necromancy? Uh, generally speaking, I mean, it's kind of frowned upon, especially since like, if you're gonna practice it, you need to like go to like a cemetery in the middle of the night and then all the rituals there, like, you know, obviously very illegal. But I mean, I think, uh, oh, you mean in the game? Everything I'm trying to do, he makes a guide on it the next day. Oh uh, yeah, so that's because I'm in your wall. I mean, um, 11,000 is like more than enough. That's actually so sick. And then look at all the mementos as well. If I ever need more souls. Wait, what? What just happened? Wait, what? I gotta ask, bro, are you good? <laughs> Ooh, imp core for Mika. All right, the mains get to eat. Fair enough, honestly. Oh my god, Mika! What is wrong with her? Back to back? Oh my goodness! Another codex for Mika. Mika's log is insane, by the way. The mains win one. Mika's had two cores, three praisal codices, and a wand and a chest in the kill count that we have done together. Oh my god. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, yeah, we're making that. We're hella making that. That is my 500th AOD kill without a codex. Eviscerate me. Yoan said, where can I buy a defense cape? Lexapro said, Lumbridge Combat Academy? Maybe stop for a lesson while you're there. Oh, man's already dead. You're going to need necromancy to bring him back. Thank you for kills, team. Did we win? That is the question on everybody's mind. No way. 54 prayer potions? Wait. 
Today is a hype day. Ah! Bro! I signed. Dude, I hate that. Oh! Crash got absolutely smoked! That was actually brutal. That scares my hardcore. Thank you for the RNG. I see you guys. I could use it. Y'all know I could use it. Here we go. Oh my- Mika! How is this possible? Can I have the streamer client back? This is so signing me. <laughs> okay. Oh god. I don't like this. I don't like this. <laughs> Team, I regret to inform you all that I do not like this. <laughs> Eat food, don't die. Eat food, don't die. Summon ghost, don't die. Eat food, don't die. Don't die, don't die. Life refresh, don't die. Don't die. Hey, look, I did it. Sacrifice me for luck? <laughs> Mika, you want me to kill you with blood sacrifice for luck? She's probably like hoping I was gonna be like, no, I would never sacrifice you, but I'm no, I'm so down. I would love to. You yeah, know, no, no discernible conscience was found. I... Even if it's like a 1% booster luck, I, I would I would be happy to end your end your existence. That's cool. Oh, I have a La Bomba. Bye Mika! <laughs> Alright. Mika has been sacrificed. Oh shit. Wait, I've been sacrificed! Oh god! Okay, no more no more memes. No more memes. Oh no! Oh boy! Did it work? I got an onyx. <laughs> okay, that was the worst idea ever. Wow, I sacrificed Mika and I started PVMing like her. And that is my 600th kill. Locked and loaded. You got perma banned from Turkey. Okay, I'm sorry. When you like break laws and get deported, that's not perma banned. Twitch lingo has gone too far. TX8 has got a core. <laughs> awesome. That reminds me, there was a teaching session, because we used to do teaching sessions, that I was running with cash, and we were doing a Farago teaching session, right? So you've got the bomb tank out, the base in, and then in the middle you have the DPS pile. I kept calling them the DPS pile, right? Cash straight up deadpan on this teaching session. He goes, honestly, based on how these kills are going so far, I think it'd be more accurate to call them the pile instead of the DPS pile. So for the whole rest of the hour, he called them the pile because they weren't doing any damage. No way! She has a thousand kill count! What? There is no way! This girl! What? The hell? Okay, honestly, screw this. Genuinely, screw this. I know we only have one kill after the hour. Tall and Mika. Done. I, I just, I need her luck for a little bit. I don't even care. What the hell? All right, I'm now Tall and Mika. Sorry, I'll, I'll give you your name back. I just, I, I need it. I need it. I need it. I'm like, I'm, I'm 650 kills deep, bro. I need it. I'm sorry. Golden pro... 1,079! I have never seen anything like that. And now it's gonna be my turn. I can't believe that. She beat me to insane fallen angel. The race was her getting insane fallen angel and me getting a singular codex. How does that even happen? That was the most lopsided race ever. I got one more hour in me, team. Also, I'm so sorry, believers. I just... She just took everything. She took everything from us. I can't find anything online about anyone getting a quicker title than that. I can't either. No, I, I've not heard of anyone getting it faster than that, personally. All right, we're going back. <laughs> Final hour. This is the last hour for real because we're getting the drop. Oh my God, yes, dude! Come on, I changed my name to Tol and Mika one, two kills ago. Two kills ago! That's insane! Literally two kills ago! What? <laughs> the name actually worked! Oh my god, that is so worth the bond. 
Let's go, dude. I got a codex. I got a freaking codex, dude. Come on. 625 AOD kills. I think we keep this name until the luck runs out. Holy crap. We just got to keep the name. That's insane. Oh, no. It's fine. <laughs> okay, not only did I bomb the team, that's... The time ago, that is so bad. That is the only time I've bombed the team in 650 kills, and it's right as I got a level. Okay, so Nathan, here's what I want you to do. I want you to edit the clip to make it look like someone else bombed the team. I don't care how you do it. And then I'm just gonna say, that's level 108 necromancy coming in. Nothing to see here. Oh my God. I'm actually just a mega trolling. We are ending our Angel of Death arc with a total of 643 kills, one codex, one in 256, by the way, a wand and a cord. These are one in 1,000 to get one of the two. So one in 2,000? Damn, we got really lucky on wands and cores, really unlucky on codices. At the end of the day, I am, uh, I am very happy. So what I want to do is first unlock this Praisal Codex ability. That's the first thing. The second thing I want to do is I want to look at all my loot because obviously like I haven't done anything with any of it. I haven't processed any of it. And then before we do any of that though, I did want to quickly thank all the people that went to AOD with me just because it was like super, super, super cool and appreciated because I'm not someone who enjoys group content a lot of the time. And I usually find team forming really stressful. And there were so many people that were just like, yeah, invite me anytime and I'll come. And so many people just absolute champions came through. So appreciated, really, really sick. Ruination. Unlock Ruination. Goodbye. And I've now got my first Praisal Codex prayer. It's not showing up in the book. There it is. Oh, it's so sick. Bang. Oh, man. That's a good look. We've got the juice. We've got the juice. So now all we need is four more tier 95 pieces. And we have completed Necromancy as our first combat style to completely max out with tier 95s. We can't really price check this outside of the elk values. 165 mil of Alks. That's not bad. I mean, to be fair, we grinded this for like a full week. So, you know, expected. But thank you all so much for watching this video. And if you enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like, a comment, and subscribe to see where the adventures of Tall and Manly will lead us next.